guys, I'm Jojo, Astro Barbie, Queen of Stars, all those things just for you. Welcome to your weekly horoscope. Wow, Halloween is on the way, my favorite holiday. I love it. Halloween is all about life. I'll tell you at the end of the show. This week, the sun, of course, is in Scorpio. Happy birthday to you, Scorpios. We love you. You made it now. I have good news for you. And yes, Halloween, especially for you, will be quite special. The moon will travel this week in the signs of Pisces, Aries, Taurus, Gemini, and Cancer. And on Tuesday, we have a powerful healing, full moon in the sign of Taurus. Great time to conclude projects, to recycle, and get rid, once and for all, of all situations and people in our lives that no longer benefit us. That means everywhere, in career, at work, in personal life, in love. It's time to clean up this week. Halloween also this week is in the sign of cancer. Therefore, it will not be too scary, quite mellow, and pretty like Hollywoodsy style. It will be a lot of fun. And of course, it's a good time to laugh at death. And to laugh at everything that is scary. And to face our fears. To enjoy everything with a smile and to become somebody else to be an actor anybody we want something scary something sexy something from the stars whatever your heart desires just be it this week because now it's a fun kind of Halloween let's enjoy also this week the last week of the last Mercury that is in the sign of Libra and that means it's sort of did you see how the 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 energy became more subtle in the news and the politics and so, and everything started making sense and the light is carrying finally over the darkness and somehow this Mercury in peace in peaceful Libra will now next Monday go into Scorpio to continue the cleanup whoa 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 so this week is a time to really enjoy again that kind of more mellow kind of justice fairness and truth kind of energy that is coming our way and also loving Venus will meet with lucky Jupiter in the sign of Virgo this week and it invites us to enjoy life to the fullest it's a beautiful connection when Venus and Mars meet that means let's have fun and let's really take a delight of being a human being okay and have fun that means eat delicious food but healthy a little bit right not too chunky chunky drink a cocktail and just have a nice glass of wine meet with people go dancing and just have fun but because this meeting of venus and mars occurs in the critical perfectionistic sign of virgo it means that actually to be moderate and wise will be easy isn't that fun so we have it all let's focus this week on the big picture and not obsess over stupid little details let's forgive let's make amends let's make a fresh start let's just do what's right we goofed we did something not right just make amends with yourself and everybody around that's the way to do this week okay scorpio scorpios my heroes happy birthday to you happy birthday to you your flowers is getting out of the earth and you are blooming into the sunshine i love you you should celebrate this week and I say also to everybody, I invite you to wish happy birthday to the extraordinary goddess Hillary Clinton because she really is on Monday. It's in her birthday. The full moon in your relationship sector, dear Scorpios, will bring you a gift of gas, some kind of vindication, an awareness of your true potential. There's excitement everywhere in your life. Love is also present. You make remarkable progress in career. You continue to turn challenges into opportunities i love it you have also more free reign to really manifest your dreams all the blockages finally are getting part of the past and now you have the freedom to move forward on the weekend definitely celebrate 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 your victory your costumes this week for halloween for next weekend dracula a fairy uh, that you could turn pumpkin into carriages or witches if you feel like to be on the bad side it's fun and anything is permitted at halloween you can do anything crazy and talking about scorpios you have do you remember all my political predictions about scorpio hillary and joe biden 
I'm always right about these things. You see, things are turning out exactly the way I say. So when you call me for predictions about your future, you could go to the bank with us. Trust me. Because that's my highest destiny and that's my greatest thing is just to make your life the best you can be. And don't worry about the future of the wonderful land of the free America. Hillary will be the next president of the USA and she is the flower that, that finally grows. She, you know flowers grow in manure. She went through the whole manure to the initiation. We all have to go through this. When you don't go to the manure, nothing happens. The flower dies and it's dark. You see, now the light will shine over her. So ambition, powerful, self-serving Trump, that Gemini, is not a good Gemini, unfortunately. He's a good guy in other ways, for family, you know, building houses and teaming up to all that stuff. But you know what? Some parks that he made, is not even there's not even an animal or a tree into there. It's just written Trump, the part that has nothing. So he showed us the dark side and he was the manure that allowed for us to see the difference between dark and light. And he gave us a gift actually. But I predict to you that he will be fired by the universe. Okay? And it's going to hurt because the Scorpio sting is going to sting. And he's going to realize that there's nothing wrong by losing sometimes. And there's nothing wrong that you've been poor sometimes. You were born with a platinum. How dare you, you know? How dare you attack and hate everyone? How dare you want to show the Statue of the Liberty out of this country? How dare you replace the statue with you? Are you kidding me with all that hate? Go back to love, Trump's baby. And you will because it's all in the stars. You have a very bad karmic dust, okay? You have what you call a dragon, dragon tail in your big fat ego Sagittarius Moon, well now, this is for you the lesson to purify all this. Well, let's send him some healing. That's what he needs. But meanwhile, let's celebrate Hillary. Sanders, I think the Virgo is a fabulous guy too. And he's, he's sort of like the stick for the plant of Hillary, for the flower to reach its full potential. It's pretty magical. Anyways, very soon I'm going to be making all kinds of predictions about all those people. You can check on my YouTube channel and you'll be able to know more about each of them in details in the astrology world. Okay? If you like it. So let's follow now with Sagittarius, my beauties, the centers. The full moon in your work sector makes you popular, kind, generous. You also feel closer to your family and friends and parents. A great time to nurture other people, to support them if they need it. The more you give, the more you receive. In life, the more we, everything we do is to ourselves. Everything we don't do is to ourselves. So really, don't you think the best way is just to give? But you do because you're generous Sagittarius. Thank you for being there. Cancer, Taurus, really care. Best costumes for you, Robin Hood, Gypsy, Fortune Teller, or some kind of gangster. That could be fun too. Your magical color red, like in number 6 and 42. Capricorn, Capricorn, the full moon in your romantic sector brings you charm, mystery, enlightenment. People are impressed by your versatility and your new witty ways. New doors open up in career. Go with the flow, investigate, ask questions. And the money picture is brighter than you thought. On the weekend, your family warms your heart and spirit. Your best costumes for Halloween? Marie Antoinette, maybe, if you want to be a sexy girl. Einstein, or maybe a priest or a nun. These are sort of the thing for you this week. Your magical color green, like in number 7 and 34. Aquarius, the full moon in your home sector brings you inner peace, unexpected surprise in career. You're lucky with powers that be and finding new employees. Contests, exams, give a chance for favors, so you should play a lottery. In career, communicate your new innovative ideas. Success is guaranteed. On the weekend, share your blessings with everyone. Your best costumes, an angel or a devil, a flower or a bird. Your magical color for share like in number 7 and 14. Pisces, the full moon in your communication sector, bring you a generous heart, a strong intuition and creativity. You attract sincere friends and love. And in career, you are making big progress. Try to spend quality time at home with your family and loved ones. Weekend, definitely you are floating with the universe. But your feet is on the ground. It's like, wow, beautiful. Your best costumes, a mermaid, exotic dancer, an astronaut. Your magical color purple, like in number 7 and 21. Aries, the full moon in your 
financial sector makes you lucky, generous, and also very patient. If you're an artist, a creator, you will do well. It's a very good time to spend time with loved ones and take care of your health and listen to your gut about everything. Don't take a decision with your mind, but with your belly. And it's very important on the weekend to listen to your dreams, to dream a little bit. Your best costumes for Halloween, Jane, Tarzan of the Jungle, Charlie Chaplin, characters like that are good. Your magical color green, lucky numbers 7 and 43. Taurus, the full moon in your sign, wow, makes you fabulously gorgeous and vibrant. And your ruler Venus near lucky Jupiter, definitely bring you a sense of victory. You know you're going to be okay. In career, take your time, listen, observe, success is on the way. And you can get a dream job or a dream project just coming to you just like that. Play lottery and on the weekend a loved one will really touch your heart. Your best costumes may be Cleopatra, uh, Caesar, Jules Caesar, exotic dancer or a vampire. Your magical color orange like numbers 8 and 35. Gemini, the full moon in your spiritual sector, uh, give you food for thought and reflection about your life. A good time to revise, clear the air and offer a new face to the world. If you have something that is better inside of you, get it out and show it before it's too late because it's time to show the angel. In career, you can finish a project, but finish what you started first and then you start a new project. And it's very important that you remember that what goes around in life comes around. So just make sure you always do things for the better good. If you don't, you will regret it. On the weekend, express your artistic sides because people are listening to you. You can connect with people also that next week could say yes to you. For your best costumes for Halloween, clown, magician, John Kennedy maybe. Your magical color red, lucky numbers 9 and 18. Cancer, cancer, that's me. This full moon, your ruler in your social sector, bring you a feeling of rebirth. If you have health issues, it's all going to pass now. You have higher energy and you're definitely making progress in some important career uh, uh, plans you are working on. You receive also the admiration of the public. Success is on the way. Just be daring. Why don't you plan a getaway, maybe for the Halloween, a romantic uh, getaway? You need to party a little bit. Don't stay home. Don't you dare. Let your imagination flow, go dancing, eat good food, have a drink and have fun. Your best costumes, a princess, a prince, a genie in a bubble, Snow White, these are all good for you. Your magical color pink, lucky numbers 10 and 21. Leo, the full moon in your career house brings hope, breakthroughs and confidence. The focus is on cooperation and teamwork. A good time to make your moves in career. Stay cool but be patient. Negotiate with a smile. And let all the memories from the past go away once and all. Make it like all positive. Family, siblings, neighbors are very understanding on the weekend. Uh, it's very, very peaceful and you feel like it's like things are happening. Any good costumes for you? Any characters with Star, Wa Star Wars or Back to the Future? Good for you. If you feel like really, really glamorous, you could go for royalty, king or queen. Your magical color gold lucky like numbers 2 and 11. Virgo, the full moon in your karmic sector and Jupiter in your sign bring you peace of mind, high intelligence, good fortune. In your personal life, you see the truth about romantic situations. Listen to other people's point of view. Put a finishing touch also to a work project. On the weekend, treat yourself to a good time. And Cancer are also very uh, generous to you. The best costumes for you, Virgo, this, this week, we are, you could be a can, can dancer if you're a girl, a Zorro, a doctor or a nurse, all fun for you. Sexy, of course. Your magical color blue, lucky numbers 3 and 20. Libra, Libra, the full moon in your shelf resources sector, your rule of Venus near Ju lucky Jupiter makes you lucky, popular. A good time to affirm your needs, promote your talents and make plans for the future. Think big. In love, choose quality over quantity. In career, protect your belongings and the, you know, if you have something that you invented, protect it. On the weekend, express your gratitude. And beautiful costumes for you for Halloween, well, maybe Marilyn Monroe, Valentino, or any kind of Hollywood star, especially from the 30s. That's what I would do if I would be you. Your magical color turquoise like numbers 4 and 22. And here's now the wizard affirmation of this mellow 
coming into the Halloween next weekend kind of week. All lost in life. You know when you lose something and it hurts? Helps us see and appreciate what is precious in our lives. The beautiful lesson of Halloween is always to face our deepest fears, what scares us the most. Oh, I think I'm gonna die. Oh my God, it's over. It's never over until it's over. All deep growth and transformations are dark and scary, but the final rewards are always worth the fear and the scare. Trust me, then navigated those water and it's true. I love you, always there for you. Get ready for Halloween. Ooh, I see the ghosts everywhere coming.